Hello, everybody! What's up? We're back reacting! One day, Sean. One day. Not happening. You're gonna do that. Not One day, I promise you. And uh, this one, I kind of threw a shock surprise at you. We're doing a reaction to something Sean had no idea about. Right? I didn't have a clue this was even a thing until you said something about it, and I have passing interest in wrestling in the 80s, so we're let's gonna see watch what this the, is about. We're going to react to the trailer for Glow. For From what I know, it is a Netflix uh, either movie or show about uh, female wrestlers in the 80s. All right, let's find out. Let's see what's going on with this, man. In this world, there are good guys and there are bad guys. And I will not be bullied into submission. Okay. You could have said faces and heels. You are reading the man's part. <laughs> oh, God. Would you like to start over? <laughs> yes, I would. I will not be bullied into submission. Sorry to interrupt. Your wife is online, too. Okay, so it sounds like a failing actress. I'm interested but... in real parts. Got $83 yeah. in my bank account, and I don't know if I can pay my gas bill. Ruth, there's an audition. They're looking for unconventional women, whatever that means. Okay. Hello, ladies. <laughs> I'm Sam Sylvia, and this is Glow. Mm -hmm. Sorry, what's Glow? Gorgeous ladies of wrestling. <laughs> oh, the it's 80s when you could say Hi, things like that. Are we wrestlers or are we the wrestlers? Go! Yes. <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Fucking actresses. <laughs> okay, I want you to meet the star of Glow, Debbie Egan. Are you insane? Why is she here? She's the Alpha and you're the Omega. Submit. <laughs> she might kill you. It's never a huge orange the new black the power, band, so. This is my first Hollywood party. There are drugs in the fucking robot. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Wrestling is about hype. You're a sexy party girl. You're an Arab. You mean stereotype. Yes. <laughs> Bingo, exactly. You're a big black girl. The fuck you say? <laughs> well, to be fair, that's what they tell the man as well. So. Uh, lady wrestlers. I get it. Women can do anything men do. Blah, blah, blah. We'll see How'd that look? I got chills. <laughs> yeah, you would. So you think I got a funny face? We're empowered. We're the heroes. You want the show to happen. This is the only place I get to do what I want to do. People respect me here. We got to shoot this thing in like five weeks. This could either feel dinky or it could feel epic. So let's give them what? Blood tits! <laughs> Blood tits and storytelling. I'm down. Again, it's like man wrestling. It's about justice. I can get on board with I don't know if this would be something I would just scroll through and watch, but. I, I might give it a passing chance. Uh, I, might. I love wrestling from the 80s. Yeah. It, it was big, over the top, and it was awesome. So, I just need like a female macho man. No, it's not gonna happen, but. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm always interested about crap like this from that time period, especially wrestling stuff. Uh, it was kind of the heyday for people like... I don't think this is based Like Hollywood on... Hulk Hogan, yeah. Macho Man, and uh, all that good stuff. Uh, it probably isn't going to be based on anything actual, but yeah. even still, it's the same time period in the atmosphere. If they can get that to match for the smaller scale that they were doing for the bigger scale, you could have something very interesting. Oh, well, here's Hogan. Uh, I, I don't really know what else to say about it. I'd, it seemed like it might be fun to watch. It could be. I hope it is. I don't know. I know That's how many have people are their... obsessed with Orange is the New Black. So A lot of people like that show. I never really fell into it. There was something about the writing that was just kind of eh to me. So. Better watch out. We already pissed DC fanboys off. We don't need to piss anybody else off. I'm sorry I didn't like something you liked. Get used to that phrase. <laughs> but if this turns out good, I'll give it a shot. Like I say, I love wrestling. I think it's wonderfully campy and over the top. If they just try and maintain that, 
I think you'll be all right, provided they don't try and take it way too seriously. Yeah. yeah. It seems yeah, like yeah. one of those shows that may go down that road, because it, it's kind of like the whole sex, drugs, okay. and rock and roll. And well, that, and that is a huge part of it, actually. Yeah. The, you should listen to some of the stories, like, Ultimate Warrior would tell. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, that man would tell you some stories. <laughs> So I know they did Dallas Page has said about his career. I know there was a bunch of drugs in the 80s, I do not know. That. Yeah, no, if you were a manager especially, it was just cocaine all the time, baby. <laughs> what happened in the 80s? Cocaine. Cocaine. <laughs> it is exactly. People stopped taking ecstasy and uh, fucking <laughs> marijuana and they were just like, fuck it, coke! <laughs> ah! Welcome to the 80s. <laughs> More or less. Oh, no. Fuck your hippie shit, mom and dad. <laughs> she don't lie, she don't lie, she don't lie. Okay. Well, that being said, <laughs> let us know what you think down in the comments. Do you think this is going to be any good? Are you interested in uh, late 80s, early 90s wrestling? Uh, sound off down there. And like and subscribe and share this video around because it helps smaller channels like ours. Please, and any feedback, anything you guys... Yeah, think would make us better. Do you think uh, one or both of us need a haircut and get a real job? Yeah, that's, that's cool too. I have a real job. <laughs> hey, I work at a movie theater. I have a real job. Fuck yeah, you me. work at the counter. I found the car counter. Oh, I see. So you get people what they need. Shut up, shut Do you have a robot full of drugs? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> That'd be awesome. You just have somebody come up and have this slick businessman come up in a suit. Yeah, is uh, Auto D5 back there today? <laughs> Why, of course, sir. Would you like his white snake approach? Yes, I would. <laughs> All right, guys. That, that, uh, uh, that's going to do us for this time. <laughs> Until next time, we'll see you guys later. <laughs>